Watch me become pro. And this is where it all started on March 8th, 2024. This is when my pro roller skating days began. Don't know, I just know I want to. Don't know, I just know I want you. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, to this video. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm having a pretty good day today. The reason why I'm having a good day today is because a lot of my packages came in, one being roller skates. We'll get into that when I open the roller skates, but I wanted to do a haul of online shopping type thing. The stores that I'm going to be showing is mostly just going to be Impala Skates and Shein. So this is going to be a Shein haul plus Impala Skates. I got a package two days ago or three days ago and i had to wait all this time to show y'all because i really wanted to just get it all done and this also feels like christmas so i'm super excited yeah i don't know how like other youtubers do it or like influencers or whatever when they have like a stack of boxes like a room filled with like pr and stuff and they're like oh yeah this is like six months worth like when i get a package in the mail especially if it's freaking free if it's free like i'm gonna open that shit immediately let's get started um what are you doing in my house also i forgot to mention that i did order a bunch of wigs um from shein uh, most of my wigs are from shein i like their wigs they're less uh expensive and they're synthetic of course i'm not gonna be out here with the lace front because i really only use it like to be at home i don't really go out with it but some of these that i got i do want to see if they're going out worthy so we're gonna be testing and trying those on as well later on in the video but also i would like to add i have a special guest here today misha. hi my name is carmen winston this is my cat misha i've had her for like 10 years now or 11 I feel like I've been saying 10 years for like a long time, but and she's just going to be here watching and I'm happy that she's here. So one of the things I got is this. It came in a, um, it came like this, but it came in a box and then it broke off. But this is it. It's a, like a body shimmer type thing. I'm going to sprint it here. Oh my God. Did you, do y'all see that? Uh it's so pretty but it does it's very faint but it's like you can tell if you're close enough um next thing i got were these uh clips for like to stick on the walls so i could put uh, my necklaces on because i got a lot of necklaces next thing i got okay i got these these are meant to be for like fake piercings like i could put them like in between my nose all that right here on my lips i love fake piercings if y'all couldn't tell i mean you... next thing i got is these nail clipper things to like cut your nails in a certain uh shape and i got those because i got hella nails like hella okay these are one of them i got a bunch of black nails of different styles um i love black nails and i have been wanting to wear nails for a good minute i do have sensory issues with it because it like does make me feel a little bit uncomfortable having them on but i'm just not used to it everything new is a little bit uncomfortable i do want to start wearing nails because everybody wears nails like everybody wears freaking nails so i want to be a baddie too you know, it just makes you feel more confident, makes you feel more put together. Like, look at me. Imagine a nice set of nails on my nails. Like, you just look so feminine, elegant, all that. One, I like press-on nails because I could take them off if I really want to. And secondly, I could reuse them. So, I got a bunch, right? I got, oh my god, these are super cute. And are they upside down? Yeah. These are like Spider-Man. You can't really tell. It just kind of looks like a little design. But they are meant to be like little Spider-Man nails. But pink. And I love that. Nails. Okay, I got these nails. These are really cute. They have like strawberries on them. I also got these. You can't see this nail. But these are pretty pretty. Like these are pretty pretty. These are pretty cute, I'd say. There's like a bow on these. Very coquette. 
Oh, these are beautiful. These are also strawberry nails. Look how cute. Oh my gosh, I'm excited to wear these. These aren't at that long either. So these will be nice to wear soon. Especially like spring's coming up. And I don't really wear red, but I just like red is so like, I don't know. I think I'm coming into my red uh, phase of my life. Maybe, maybe it's coming up. Maybe I'm feeling it in my soul because I, I'm starting to really have an appreciation for the color red. I just not, but now I do. I got these as well. Oh my God, these are really pretty. I got these white nails. These are like, I don't know how to describe them, but I like the design on them. Oh, these are beautiful. Look at these. The rhinestones, they're pretty basic, but they're really cute. One thing that I've heard is that the charms fall off, but it's okay, because we just stick them back on. That's it, that's all we gotta do. These are beautiful, look at these. Can y'all see? These are so pretty, and these were a little bit more expensive, I believe, like the ones that are like a little bit more attention to detail are a little bit more expensive, but these are so pretty, and they're not that long as well. I got these nails. These are also, they're from Romney, which is like a Shein, like Shein's cousin or some shit. But these are also very beautiful. Like, hello. These are so me. Like, if I were nails, these would probably be nails I'd, that I'd be. They're so pretty. Like, hello. These are freaking beautiful. Oh my god. You can see. That's really cute. I freaking have a countdown on how many times I say cute. I'm going to try not to. After this point, I'm not going to say that. Oh my god. Last but not least, because I think these are the last nails I got off there. But these are just gorgeous. Look at that. And they look very similar to the picture. These are very, like, witchy type nails. And I like that. Next, I got lashes. got these lashes. They're pretty simple. I have lashes on right now, but these are, I don't know if they're in this pack or in the next one, but the ones I'm wearing, but here are these. I love spiky lashes. I don't really like fluffy lashes. Like I've noticed that by myself. They just don't really look that great on me. I also got these. So these are kind of similar to the ones I have on now, but these are a little bit more fluffed out, but they're still spiky and I like that. Then this is like the one of my one of the things I'm most excited about is this um, like eyeliner type palette where you just wet the brush and then like touch any of these and like it activates as, as to an eyeliner or like eyeshadow. I'm in like I don't know what I want. If I'm being honest with y'all, I don't know. But because on one hand, I'm like, I don't really want makeup anymore because this, that, and third, like sometimes I catch myself depending on wearing makeup. I was wearing makeup right now. Fun fact, I'm only wearing makeup, not that it matters because if I don't want to wear makeup, I will, wear, I will wear makeup. I don't need any excuses to, but I wasn't planning to wear it today, but I had no motivation to go to my um, class, my lab class. It's four freaking hours and it's on a Friday. So I was like, oh damn, I kind of don't want to go. I didn't go last week, so I was like, shh. Um, but I didn't motivate myself and I just made myself look cute with this little hairstyle. So then I was like, okay, like, I need to go out. That's a hack. If y'all want something, if y'all need something to motivate you, do your makeup or like do your hair or like pick out a cute outfit and then you're like okay i have to go out now anyways back to what i was saying about this so i'm i get into those moods sometimes but i also want to like experiment with like colors especially with makeup and like eyeshadow and stuff and like eyeliner so this is the best thing i could get right now i got this iridescent belt i love this belt it has like a normal buckle look how like, can you see it? I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but that is just, oh my. I love iridescent things. Like, it just reminds me of a fairy, and this is this is exactly what I needed. These are my go-to lashes. They're not the lashes I'm wearing right now, but these are my go-to lashes. Like, um, comfortability, comfortability wise, and also they're cute, and yeah, not. Um, heavy on the eyes, and you kind of forget that you're wearing them. And yeah, it comes with a pack of eight. And the only reason I bought like two packs of these, and they ran through for like two months, um, which is a little bit of time. But I was just throwing away. <laughs> like, I'm not a big consumer, so I'm just like, uh, but we have a solution for that. Um, what is this, you ask? What is this? Hold on a Let me freaking tell you. Oh, okay. Oh, look, that's for you guys. The look, it's a lash like holder thing, and it comes with a mirror. Come on, I didn't even know it came with a mirror. I didn't even know until I opened it, but look at that. I got this necklace. It's just a flower, and it, it's, like, really long. 
y'all can see this is how long it is it even works like in how i have my necklaces stacked up you can you can't even see it from there uh oh no um oh shit stop this is how long it is fuck y'all get the freaking point it's pretty long much like the rest of them my necklaces are pretty long the ones i'm about to show but there's some that are shorter i got this one and i mostly got it for the chain so then i could like swap out pendants but this pendant's really cute i got that and then i got this one so pretty it's like it looks like an opal but it's not but it does look like it look like shiny but yeah it's also pretty long as well and then i got this necklace it's it's like this little um like cross or star with the moon and then i got this little red oh, what is it? this little red like vampire necklace like look at that oh my god i love this so much it's not something i normally wear and i'm gonna try to like style it in, in some way but wow that's pretty that's very beautiful um then i got these little widget things for my crops and look it's like samuel wait look at that oh my gosh i'm so excited they have i think it comes with samuel my melody karomi and hello kitty i got this i got this glitter um thing it's, you can use it for your skin for your hair apparently like that's it says for face and hair and body. So now we're going to go into the second bag. This bag I have not seen because it just came in today. First thing I see off the bag is this. I didn't know she in like had so many Sanrio things. A little like Lego set. And I have a similar one that I got at Riso Life, something like that. Or Tesso, Tesco? Yes. I got that there and I got this one. So I'm really excited to build that. I'm going to do that. Okay. I got like three lipsticks in different shades. So we might try them on today. I got this shade. It looks more orangey on camera, but it's not, I promise you. It's like a burgundy. Then I got, I got a black one as well. Because black lipstick, I don't know. I don't think I've ever tried it, but I want to. So I feel like black lipstick looks good on everyone, in my opinion. Did Rihanna say that? I think she did. Because she knows what she's talking about. Hopefully it looks good on me. This one, this is, it looks brown, but it's not. <laughs> not on camera, but... I mean, it is on camera, but it's not in real life. It's like a burgundy, but like a little bit of a brown, but not as much as a brown as it's showing. Okay, I believe this is the back one. I swear. Because I only, I got the other two because I was like, oh, that's cute. But I really only pressed on it because of the black one. Look at that. I don't know if I want to try it now. Maybe we could try one of them out. We could try this one out, okay? Let me get my mirror. Now, I put lip gloss on <laughs> before recording, so... Oh, it smells- oh! That smells good. That smells like lotion, like hand lotion. Oh, uh, maybe I should take this off. Uh, okay. Fuck it, we will. So. Do we like it? Yes, we do. Yeah, just not a lot. I mean, no, I do like it. I just don't put too much, I think. I think for me, I just like tints of things. I don't really like lipstick. But, I feel like it does complement my skin my skin tone my hair so yeah i like it okay these are the lashes that i'm wearing actually these came in this package yeah and these are what they look like okay that's this way and just into the picture here it's really cute on people i saw reviewing it so quickly looks cute on me this is a long-haired one with layers and bangs and it's kind of similar to how my hair looks now but i just wanted to see like how this one would look and like if like i don't feel like doing my hair I could just put it away put it out on top of day and then I got this one, which has like green little like highlights. Oh my god, I'm excited to try this one out, but also nervous because I, I hope it looks good. But I'm gonna try that out in a bit. For the for what we've all been waiting for, what I've been waiting for, my oh ah, my roller skates! I'm so excited. Okay, I'm gonna go get them. This is the box is huge. Okay, I'm so excited. They're not anything crazy. They're just plain black, but I wanted it that way because I don't know how to roller skate yet. And I don't want to be, like, riding around with, like, obnoxious roller skates when I don't even know how to roller skate. You know what I mean? Like, I'll wear the obnoxiously cute <laughs> roller skates once um, I know what the frick I'm doing. Okay. Okay. Okay, so it comes with another box. All right. But look. Okay, I got this bag. It was $9, okay? Because... I was like, why not? Like, I need a, I actually do need a bag to store my um, roller skates. And look how cute this is. It says Impala. I like that. Come on. Then, okay, I got um, the protective gear, of course, because we're not going to bust our ass without being protected. I literally don't even, I don't know what to say. I don't know literally what to say this is gorgeous 
so I try to be all thematic. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm out of breath. <laughs> Look at them. These are beautiful. And they feel so nice. Okay, I'm going to try one of them on. These are my first roller skates, guys. Like, watch me become pro. And this is where it all started on March 8th, 2024. This is when my pro roller skating days began. And when I get to the Olympics or where, whatever, they're going to show this video. <laughs> they're going to show me unboxing this because what the heck. Okay, this is one thing. I don't understand why people be like, I'm not sponsored. Like, of course you're not. <laughs> I'm, of course, I'm not sponsored by freaking Impala Skates. Impala Skates, you're going to sponsor me. I'm right here, but of course I'm not. <laughs> I have like 20 subscribers right now, but obviously I'm just like, I'm letting y'all know this is the real deal right now. Oh no, I think it's falling apart. Wait, <laughs> maybe you should have thought this through. Yeah, maybe you should have, girlfriend. Maybe you should have thought this through. I don't know. I don't know anything about roller skating as of right now. I bought these kind of like, think of when a grown man goes through a midlife crisis and he buys himself like a red convertible or like a race car or something you know what i mean like this is what this is to me i've been going through a phase in my life where i just feel very like uninteresting i don't really know how to explain it i just feel like i could be doing more with my life and like experiencing things that i like to do more rather than like not doing anything and one step of me like getting out of this is doing youtube because i always wanted to do youtube like ever since i was little like since elementary school so obviously i started doing youtube but i also was like man i always wanted to learn how to skate, and i'm gonna dedicate myself boom this is what she looks like. I am so excited. Obviously, I'm going to do vlogs and y'all are going to see my progress in this. I am feeling really great right now. And I'm very thankful. Very thankful that I could, I could afford all these things that make me feel happy. But, you know, happiness is temporary when it comes to objects and things. However... These bad boys will make me happy for I'm so happy. I'm feeling really great. I'm feeling like money's well's worth right now. Y'all guess what? Um, I look <laughs> crazy, but obviously this isn't the type of um wig cap you're meant to wear, but I don't know where my other ones are and I might have to order some new ones because I always lose them. I think we're gonna go for this one that I already tried on because I already tried it on and I want y'all to see. I honestly, in my personal opinion, I feel like it looks better in a hat, which most synthetic wigs have that, that they look better in a hat. But I've seen people like style this wig and like without a hat and it looks good. So I should probably have done the wig cap better because there's a big boob i'm gonna fix my wig cap and i'm gonna do it the correct way and i'll be back and we'll see how this looks okay. now that i look like um hot lunch lady which all lunch ladies are freaking hot oh we're gonna see how this looks now okay so this is what she's looking like <laughs> obviously there's a little bit of a difference now but still pretty much looks the same. But I just can't tell like in what way it looks cute without a hat. Because it's giving edgy grandma. But it's also giving like edgy girl. I don't know. I think I like it. We're going to test her with the hat test. And look. This to me looks so much better. Like it's giving skater girl. It's giving like look. I'm a completely different person right now okay look like i'm giving like milf like but grandma edition <laughs> like i feel like hat is the way to go when it comes to this wig which most wigs are that's the way to go but like let me know what y'all think oh my god he said so life is strange coded can y'all see that i love that i feel like without the Meaning, I don't feel like it suits me. I don't think it looks great on me. Maybe I have to style it a little bit more, but right, right now, it's not giving without the hat. Also, the length, although I like the length in the front, I feel like the length in the back kind of like messes up with um, the, the gold cap. 
or the cap, the whatever the wig cap, because um, as you can see, like you can see my hair right there. Like this is that. So unless I move my thing back, like I don't know, it just makes it very noticeable that it is a wig from the back. You know what I mean? But from the front, like for pictures and stuff, I think it's really cute. It's giving um, grandma, but very sexy, very hot, very cute, very feminine grandma, very with the times type of grandma for me. I hope, hopefully, when I'm a grandma, I look like this and I look this good because stiff wear. For real, stiff wear. Oh, oh, no way. Stiff wear. Maybe with my glasses. <laughs> See, this is giving grandma 2.0, grandma central, but hot and studious. If you can pull it, pull it off. All the power to you. Next wig, kind of similar, is this green wig taking it off i really hope i like this one but i feel like i'm not going to okay <laughs> this is <laughs> what it looks like on i feel like i look i feel like i look crazy i feel like i look crazy oh my god i'm giving hip mom i'm giving karen i'm giving edgy karen them and is that really a bad thing maybe i think it's definitely the bangs need like work because the bangs are like at this length that i look like i have no freaking eyebrows and i know that's like the style going on right now but i don't want that this is definitely a cosplay wig and i don't know what the fuck i would cosplay um <laughs> with this wig i feel like i don't know all right let's let's try with the hat and then maybe i'll feel something different no the hat makes it look worse <laughs> i like the color a lot but what is my me Where's my me? I feel like also if I just pin this back a little bit, it won't look as bad. I don't know. I don't hate it. Like, I'm gonna be real. I don't hate it. But it def definitely looks wig. Like, this is a wig. And is that a bad thing? No. Not necessarily. But it's not like a wig you'd wear out. In terms of wearing it out, I would not recommend. Unless you're into the wig look, um, then yeah, go for it. And honestly, who am I to tell you what to fucking do? Go out and rock that shit. Who gives a fuck if it's a wig? Okay? Who cares? You're gonna rock it and you're gonna look great if you get this wig, alright? But personally, I wouldn't wear it out. That's just me. I wouldn't wear it out. Not because I wouldn't rock it and not because I wouldn't look good in it. It's just I feel yeah. like it's a very different look for me. It looks it's giving it's giving Nana. It's giving Nana if she had the green going on. Like this is what Nana would look like. Honestly, I would rate this wig a hmm. I would rate it a seven or a six point five out of ten. I don't think I would ever wear it out personally. And I just not really me. Maybe it is me. Maybe maybe it's what I said. New things are uncomfortable, but that doesn't mean it's bad. I don't know. Um, it's definitely giving one <laughs> for sure. Um, but I feel like other people could rock it better and people that know how to do wigs or people know how to style it so yeah i will give it a 6.5 i think it's good i think anyone that wants to get this wig regardless and they see it on me maybe maybe y'all see something different maybe y'all still like it i think y'all could style it and if y'all could style it and make it look good you can rock anything girlfriend uh, but for me personally i just i don't think i would wear it out or maybe again this is her right off the bat and she is gorgeous i think this one's really giving so well, i'm liking it a lot now we're gonna try it with the beanie test hmm okay surprisingly the beanie doesn't do it justice wow me going on and on about every wig looks good with the beanie i don't think this one does maybe because it camouflages with the color it's black and i just feel like i look emo which there's nothing wrong with that but it's just not my style i keep asking this but if i was out here i'd be like hey guys me 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 y'all wouldn't bat an eye i don't think maybe maybe you would maybe i'll be like oh she's wearing a little wig who cares i am one thing i hope everyone gets from uh this review and one thing i want to get from this review who gives a fuck really if it's a wig if you guys care that's fine you know what i mean but like if someone like it's a wig 
it is a wig you know what i mean and it's not an insult i guess like i think personally with like some of my things i'm like i don't want people to perceive me in a certain way or whatever but who cares like if i'm elevating my looks then who cares you know and i'm i don't know anything about wigs i just buy them and wear them sometimes to take pictures and maybe i'll go out with them also my cat no look at her she's in the box I think it looks amazing. I think it looks great. I'm feeling myself for real. I'm feeling myself. Yeah. Back to the rating. I would rate this a. I'd rate it a nine out of ten. Getting a ten for me would be that it'd be a little bit thicker, and the the bangs would fit a little bit better on my face. I feel like it does fit good, but a little bit better. And. Mm, that's about it. If you're like me and you're always like, Oh, I want to change something about myself, but I can't. Or I want to change my hair, but I can't. Go get a wig. Go get a wig and like experiment with like the things you like and your style and your appearance and stuff like that. And it could just be for fun, like for pictures and stuff, just to make y'all you feel good, you know. Just wear the wig, you know. Don't damage your hair, just wear a wig. That's my saying. Honestly, this is my favorite one, and I hope I made this review as honest as I could. I obviously did. I feel like I did, so I did. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys, I made you chuckle, made you laugh. But let me know if you guys decide to get any of the things that I got. Shout out Impala skates, roller skates. Don't shout out because I'm not sponsored, but shout out them because this bad boy is going to come with me everywhere now. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.